What is up, YouTube? This is PZC Essien here. So, tomorrow we are going to be going down to the beach, and that will be the beginning of Beach Trip 2014, which I am very much excited about. And it has occurred to me that I never actually made a Zippo wishlist video. Because every year that we go, I do like to get myself a nice Zippo or two, uh, just so that way I can have a little bit of a memory about the trip. Uh, so, yeah, because of that, I like to find specific ones, just so that it's kind of like a, I guess a scavenger hunt, I guess, I don't know. So anyways, let me go ahead and let's get into this. So what you're looking at right now is actually what made up last year's Zippo wish list. So for last year we have the Lurid Green, the Ebony, and the Grey Dusk. As you can see, I managed to get all of them, however, only this one was bought at the beach. These two I had to order separately online. So, this year, I've actually got three more that I'm going to be actively seeking out. The first of which is actually the Ace of Spades Zippo. Now, this isn't going to be any fancy Ace of Spades Zippo. This is the basic Ace of Spades Zippo. This high-polished chrome one with a little spade in the middle that it just basically looks like a regular old generic Ace of Spades card. I have always wanted this one, <laughs> and I can't believe I never actually managed to, you know, work myself up to getting one. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to be looking for this one. I see it every single year, so I'm hopeful I'll see it again this year, and if I do, I'm going to snag it up. So that is going to be the first one. Now, the second one is actually a new one for this year. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to find it, but... You know, knowing some, knowing the shops over there, I would it honestly wouldn't surprise me if I did see it. And if I do see it, I will make sure to snag it up. Uh, it's the Keep Calm and Flame On Zippo. I love that one. That's a really nice Zippo. It's a red mat with the white text on it, Keep Calm and Flame On. It's got the little Zippo logo underneath it. Uh, it basically, it just looks like those Keep Calm products, like the Keep Calm and Carry On type deal. Uh, it's, it's Keep Calm and Carry On. Uh, no, well... They do make a zipper that says keep calm and carry on, but this one is keep calm and flame on. <laughs> Anyways, that was a bit of a mouthful. So yeah, I really want that one. Uh, it's a ni Again, it's a nice red matte zipper, which I don't have, and I would love to get one of those. Uh, this is one that I was actually planning on getting next. Anyway, so I was actually going to order this one for my own collection, but I never really got around to it. So if I can find this one there, I will be more than happy to just go ahead and snag it up there, and it'll make a nice little souvenir. Uh, and then finally, the last one is a bit of a basic model, uh, a white mat. Yep, I would love a white mat Zippo. If I could get myself a white mat Zippo, that would be epic. But here's the other thing. Uh, I'm also thinking if I can't find the Keep Calm and Flame On Zippo, I could probably just go for a standard red mat Zippo. Although, I'm also thinking that, you know, then if I, whenever I do get around to getting uh, the Keep Calm and Flame On Zippo, I sh I'll just call it the Keep Calm Zippo, because that's a big mouthful. <laughs> uh, but whenever I do wind up getting that one, then I'd actually have two Zippos that are very similar to each other, and I don't want that. So, I'll probably just go for a white one no matter what. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Just a really, really simple, quick video. Uh, again, I'm, the ones that I'm definitely going to be seeking after, and if I see them, I will snag them up, is the Ace of Spades... Zippo, alright, and then we'll have the Keep Calm Zippo, the Keep Calm and Flame On. That one looks awesome, and that is one that I'm planning on getting soon anyway. Uh, and then finally, just a standard white mat, because I just think they look awesome, and I, you know, as, as just, yeah, they're just nice, because they're really simple, and yeah. <laughs> so anyways, guys, that is actually going to do it for this video. Again, really, really short compared to last year's, so thank you all for watching. I will see you in my next video which will probably be uh, tomorrow. I am i don't know what kind of videos I'm going to make throughout the week, but it's going to be a little bit different this year because, um, well, today we're actually doing the packing because uh, tomorrow we're actually going to be leaving a lot earlier than normal just due to the way certain things are working out. So it's going to be a little bit different in that regard. I know Day Zero from last year was very well accepted, and I was very excited about that. I really enjoy last year's Day, day Zero. Uh, but it's going to be a little bit more like straight straight on to the beach, I guess. There's not really going to be much, if any, 
uh, actual like packing footage or whatever. So there's that. We're basically going to be leaving really early in the morning. But on the bright side, we're going to be getting there really, you know, a lot earlier than normal. So we'll actually be able to do stuff, which I am very excited about. So that's going to be cool. Um, so yeah, because of that, we need to pack today. And I actually really haven't started because I hate packing. It's like I put it off. It's it's one of my least favorite things to do. Um, so anyways, guys, that's going to do it. Uh, be looking forward to tomorrow, or just be looking forward to the beach trip videos. I'm going to definitely try and get you guys some good ones, try and make them even better than last year, uh, to the best of my ability. So thanks for watching, and adios.